people look for him thousands of Beidou. Suddenly looking back, the person was there, dimly lit. Xin Kiji you trash. What do you eat? If there is any accident to Rui Rui, I will let you all go to the funeral. An elegant middle-aged man wearing a silver-gray suit and gold-wire glasses. At this moment, his eyes were fierce, and he angrily slammed the teacup into the ground. The teacup was torn apart, and some fragments flew to the bodyguards in black. But these black bodyguards dare not move, chilling. A dignified and elegant woman wearing a navy blue Chong Sam with gold trim came over. She said softly, Brother Kong, don't get angry, but don't get angry. Ryriji people have their own eyes, and she will wake up. How bad a mother is. If you hadn't been pampering her and spoiling her, why would she go racing with a bunch of messy people? Lin Zikeng pushed Su Man's hand away, his eyes filled with anger. Su Man's eyes flashed. She sucked her nose and said aggrievedly, Brother Kong, look at me, didn't you teach Xiao Xiao well? But Rui Rui is different. Anyway, I am not her biological mother, and I can't treat her too much. Stern, and she has a big temper. She hasn't listened to me very much. I tried my best. Kong, I am so good to Rui Rui, and it is all for you. I know that in your heart I will never be better than nothing. On. Okay, okay, don't talk about it, don't mention the past. Lin Zikeng was a little annoyed to hear, but he saw his wife's red eye circles and did not continue to blame. At this moment, a medical staff hurriedly pushed the door in. He was very surprised and said, Mr. Lin, the eldest lady is awake. Really? Lin Zikang's eyes lit up, he immediately made three and two steps, eagerly pushed the door out, and rushed to the VIP ward next to him. Su Man was stunned. After the surprise, a flash of resentment flashed through his eyes. That dead girl actually woke up? The car was broken and it was still alive? What kind of luck is this? In the VIP ward here, Lin Zikeng has rushed to his daughter's side. He watched his daughter sitting on the hospital bed, covering her head with one hand, her eyebrows frowning tightly. Lin Zikeng immediately asked very nervously, Rui Rui, how are you feeling and where are you feeling? Dad, let the expert doctor come to do a full body examination for you. After saying this, he said to the doctor next to him, What are you still doing? Hurry up and let all the expert doctors come over. Yes, yes, Mr. Linear. Seeing the doctor hurriedly leave to find someone, Lin Rui's eyebrows wrinkled again. Her memory still remains at the moment when she failed to cross the tribulation and was struck by the thunder. Just now, as soon as Lin Rui opened his eyes, a huge amount of information suddenly flooded into his head all about the original owner of the body. The original owner's name is also Lin Rui, and she is a domineering and thoughtless eldest lady. Obviously the driving level was average, and I had to take the test more than a dozen times when I took the driver's license test, but I was fooled into racing. As a result, there was an accident during the drag racing. The car fell over the railing and was almost scrapped. The original owner, Lin Rui, was also in this accident. This allowed her from Kanglin continent to come back to life. Although the eldest lady was quite mindless, what Lin Rui said now was also living through her body. Lin Rui is very grateful to her. Lin Rui thought, in the future, look for opportunities to repay her. Looking up, Lin Rui recognized the middle-aged man in front of him, and it was Lin Zikang, her biological father. As a self-made businessman, Lin Zikeng is ruthless and ruthless in the mall. But he especially loved Lin Rui, the only daughter left behind by his wife. Lin Rui was a little uncomfortable with Lin Zikeng's enthusiasm for a while. At this moment, she squinted and reflected through Lin Zikeng's lenses and saw a bunch of colorful hair. She touched her face subconsciously, and finally hit a bunch of earrings on her ears. Lin Rui pushed Lin Zikeng away suddenly, jumped out of the bed, limped, and ran to the mirror in the next bathroom. When she saw the smoky makeup in the mirror, wearing a row of earrings and dyed colorful hair, 
the corners of her mouth twitched. This, what monster? Lin Zikang ran in in a panic and said, Rui Rui, are you okay? Go back to the hospital bed and lie down, your foot is still hurt. Dad, I'm fine, I just want to clean it up. Lin Rui took a deep breath, pushed Lin Zikang out of the bathroom and locked the door. She didn't care about the bruises on her body, including the broken leg. For those who have been stunned, what kind of injury is this? It's just that this outfit is really hot eyes. If it hadn't been learned from the memory of the original owner that the original owner was just an ordinary mortal, not a monster, Lin Rui would have thought that the person in the mirror was a monster. Lin Rui didn't understand, she was a good girl, why did she dress up like this? Lin Rui began to remove a bunch of earrings on her ears, and then found out that there was a umbilical ring. As for the colorful hair, after Lin Rui washed it several times with water, the color was even more terrible. She thought about it for a while, found the scissors from the side, sent it fiercely, and cut it all off. Strands of hair fell on the ground, and slowly, a beautiful face slowly revealed. It was actually seven or eight similar to Lin Rui's original appearance. And the hair is very short, a bit messy, coupled with that beautiful face, unexpectedly formed a different kind of glamorous effect. Su Man quickly sorted out his emotions and walked in. Seeing the empty hospital bed, she was stunned. Is it possible that Lin Rui just turned back to the light, and has now been sent for rescue? It's best to die. However, she still pressed the raised corners of her mouth, and looked at Lin Zikang with concern, Ji Kong, where's Rui Rui? Is she? She's in the bathroom. Lin Zikang was also a little stunned. The moment his daughter pushed him just now was quite exciting. But he is more worried about his daughter's body. Lin Zikang yelled at the people around him, Where are those doctors? Come over to me quickly. When Rui Rui comes out, she will be checked up immediately. Su Man heard that Lin Rui was in the bathroom. People are not all half dead, even if they can wake up, they shouldn't be alive and kicking. At least, you don't have the ability to act for now, right? But what happened to Lin Rui? Su Man's mood here is like riding a roller coaster, up and down, happy and sad. I don't know how long it took before the bathroom door creaked. A short-haired girl in a hospital gown walked out slowly. Although her face was pale, her hair was very short and uneven. But that beautiful face made everyone in the ward stunned. Okay, so beautiful. The girl suddenly raised her head, her sharp eyes, as if engulfed with a cold wind, swept over everyone. Everyone thought of it in unison, I rely on, okay, so fierce. Lin Zikang hasn't seen her daughter without makeup for many years. He still remembered the sweet and lovely little jade figure in his memory. Looking at the girl in front of him with the appearance of a wife, Lin Zikang suddenly choked up, Rui Rui. Lin Rui knew that Lin Zikang was really good to herself, and her chin nodded slightly and gave a barely audible hum. Then, her gaze turned to Su Man who was standing beside Lin Zikang. This woman. Lin Rui has already learned from memory that this woman is the stepmother of the original owner and the best friend of the original owner's biological mother. In front of people, especially Lin Zikang, Su Man is always gentle and virtuous. In fact, she has treated Lin Rui very well over the years. It can even be said that it is very good. Excellent. So good. Lin Rui wants stars, Su Man will never give them to the moon. When Lin Rui wanted to learn makeup, Su Man asked Lin Rui a dozen makeup artists, all of whom were very exaggerated makeup artists, and bought half a house of cosmetics. Later, Lin Rui got older and likes to buy beautiful clothes, bags, and shoes. Su Man let people buy all kinds of luxury goods from abroad to fill the room. Everyone thought that Su Man was the best stepmother in the world. It's better to Lin Rui than to her biological daughter Lin Xiao. However, when Lin Rui wanted to smoke and drink, and wanted to fight with others, Su Man also unconditionally supported. Even in front of Lin Zikang, Su Man kept helping Lin Rui cover up. 
In short, what Lin Rui wants and what he wants to do, even if it is illegal, Su Man indulges and supports him infinitely, and he also guides him intentionally or unintentionally. The original owner Lin Rui even thought that this stepmother was better than her biological father. Not long ago, the original owner, Lin Rui, was coaxed by Su Man to transfer his shares to Su Man. Fortunately, Lin Zeking knew that his daughter was ignorant, and he didn't let up on the matter of shares. Those shares were a common goffage gift he was going to give Rui Rui to her when she turned 18. For this, Lin Zeking also blamed Su Man. Su Man couldn't help crying on the spot, saying that he didn't know anything, Rui Rui insisted on giving it to her. Lin Rui was also trying to speak for his stepmother there. In the end this matter had no choice but to stop. What this stepmother Su Man did to the original owner Lin Rui. A light flashed in Lin Rui's eyes. There is only one word in her mind, to kill. Su Shi Lin Rui's eyes stayed on her body for a long time. Su Man smiled awkwardly, and then walked over, as if to help Lin Rui. She said, Rui Rui, you just woke up and your body is still weak. Go to bed and lie down quickly. If you get hurt again, we will feel distressed. Lin Rui paused, but did not push Su Man away. When Su Man saw that Lin Rui was the same as before, her heart was also placed in her stomach. She looked at Lin Rui's beautiful profile with a little jealousy, but her voice was gentle, Rui Rui, why did you cut your hair so short? How beautiful is the long hair before? Girls, you still have to have long hair. Good looking. Do you think I used to look good? Lin Rui asked back. Yes, haven't you always liked it? Su Man nodded. Lin Rui finally understood how the original owner's makeup on his eyes came from. In addition to the original owner's slightly crooked aesthetic, there is also the credit of this stepmother Su Man. Although this Su Man is very scheming, but Lin Rui is someone who has lived for hundreds of years. Are you afraid of this woman? The corner of Lin Rui's mouth raised, but her eyes were very naive. She said, Oh, since Aunt Su likes that look. Why don't you perm your hair that way tomorrow, and then dye it in seven colors? And makeup, do the same, anyway, those makeup artists are you if you find it, let them go and put your makeup on. I. The expression on Su Man's face solidified. She just raised her head and saw Lin Zikang's suspicious look. Su Man laughed twice and quickly said, Hey, you young people like that non-mainstream. I can't. I'm old and I'm not suitable to dress like that. Oh, you are quite old, and indeed you are not suitable for dressing up. Or else, let Lin Xiao turn into that kind of makeup. The smile on Su Man's face couldn't hold back. This girl is endless, right? But for so many years, Su Man has always maintained the image of a good-tempered mother, Mrs. Wen Wanlin. Therefore, even if she was reborn, there were still so many people around at this time, let alone Lin Zikang still nearby. Su Man's stomach fire couldn't come out either. She was right when Lin Rui just woke up and had a temper. Anyway, this dead girl's temper has always been great, but she is very foolish. What she has in the future is to make this stinky girl become resentful and resentful. Su Man said softly, Rui Rui will do whatever she wants but now the most urgent task is for you to take a good rest. You don't know, your dad and I are both worried about you. Here Lin Zikang has asked the doctors to come over to check Lin Rui's body, and then he said to Su Man, Xiao Man, go home and arrange for someone to take care of Rui Rui, prepare some of her usual clothes, and do some of the food that suits her now. Rui Rui doesn't like to eat dishes made by other chefs outside. N, okay. Su Man replied. She looked at Lin Zikang's worry about Lin Rui's appearance, and the moment she turned and left, her eyes became extremely cold. In Lin Zikang's eyes, no one is less important than Lin Rui, a dead girl. And Lin Rui is especially like her mother, who is Lin Zikang's wife Fang Yuluo. Therefore, Lin Rui's existence reminds Su Man over and over again that you are just a stepmother. 
You will never compare to Lin Zikang's wife, and you will never compare to the woman who has been dead for many years. Su Man angrily stepped on high heels and left. The doctor here also began to examine Lin Rui. After some examinations, the expert doctor headed by him was very surprised. He said to Lin Zikang, Mr. Lin, Miss Lin, except for the bruises on her body and the minor fractures on her legs, everything else is fine. As long as you take a good rest, you will definitely be back to health in two months. Originally, Lin Rui hit the head and was almost judged to be brain dead. Looking at her daughter sitting here, Lin Zikang is really grateful to God. In order to give her daughter a better rest, Lin Zikang drove everyone out of the ward. And he also ordered no one to disturb his daughter Lin Rui during this period. After all this was arranged, his face appeared tired. Lin Zikang's nerves have been tense since he learned of his daughter's accident, and now he dared to breathe a sigh of relief. Lin Rui looked at Lin Zikang blankly. Before, she had no parents or family members, and she had the best relationship with the apprentice Axing and Kai Bao, not counting the people in the fairy gate. Now seeing Lin Zikang caring about herself so much, her heart softened. Perhaps some emotions of the original owner are still affecting her. However, Lin Rui did not dislike this feeling. She said softly, Dad, you also go home and rest. I'm fine here. If you still don't worry about me, just leave a few bodyguards here to protect me. Suddenly his daughter cared about him so much, Lin Zikang was taken aback, and his eye circles started to turn red. Rui Rui, you care about father so much. Lin Rui learned from memory that the original owner had caused trouble before. Lin Zikang was very disappointed and angry again and again, but even so, Lin Zikang was kind to Lin Rui, but he never stopped. This may be the affection of blood thicker than water. Lin Zikang, who was arrogant in the mall, had red eye circles at this moment, like a child who was about to cry. Lin Rui raised the corner of his mouth and said, being a daughter who cares about her father is a matter of course, isn't it? Lin Zikang was taken aback, nodded very reservedly, then turned around and walked out calmly. But his pace got faster and faster. If he continues to stay, he might cry in front of his baby girl. That would be shameful. It will definitely affect her glorious image in her daughter's heart. The others are gone. But after a while, Su Man brought Lin Rui's change of clothes and some daily necessities. She said she wanted to stay with Lin Rui, but Lin Rui refused. Because the original owner often lost his temper, Su Man didn't think much about it. She was very patient and tempered and said that if Lin Rui needed it, she would rush over immediately. He also said a lot to express his deep concern for Lin Rui. Lin Rui didn't look up, only one word back, okay. Su Man. Su Man, who was choked, used his powerful acting skills to make a gentle smile on his face again. Rui Rui, then I will leave first. This time, Lin Rui did not lift his head. Su Man was so angry that his back molars were about to be crushed, but he was helpless. She had to turn around and leave in high heels. After the ward was completely quiet, Lin Rui rolled up the sleeve of the hospital gown. The quaint bracelet on her slender wrist was revealed. This bracelet was bought by the original owner Lin Rui at an auction before. In fact, this is also Lin Rui's thing. That's why Lin Rui would wake up in her body after the death of the original owner. The pattern on the bracelet is very strange, and there are some places on it that have been splashed with blood. It must have been splashed by the original owner when he had a car accident. Originally, when Lin Rui had an operation, the doctors wanted to remove the bracelet first. But I don't know what's wrong, this bracelet can't be taken off. Because it was urgent to save people, no one took care of it later. Lin Rui stroked the bracelet very tenderly. She felt a very kind atmosphere in the bracelet, as if responding to her. Lin Rui's eyes also became very gentle. After reciting a word in silence, the next moment, the world revolves around. When Lin Rui opened her eyes again, she found that she was no longer in the ward. 
she came to a space where there is no cave. The light in this space is a bit dark, surrounded by endless grass, which looks a bit deserted. There is a bamboo building not far away. In front of the bamboo building there is a stream of spring water. Next to the spring water, there is a beautiful boy who seems to be walking out of the painting. The little boy is about six or seven years old, with short black hair, golden eyes and wearing a white robe studded with silver patterns, bare feet, sitting on the grass and fishing board. Although, there are no fish in this spring. When Lin Rui appeared, the little boy was taken aback. The next moment he wowed, like a small cannonball, rushing towards Lin Rui. Lin Rui's current body is much worse than her back then. Coupled with having just experienced a car accident, it is extremely weak to win. Lin Rui sat down on the ground when he was hit by the little boy. But the little thing was already snorting and crying. Master, you finally woke up. It's been almost a thousand years, and Kai Bao has finally seen you again. You 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 you. The Kai Bao was originally a chess piece in front of the Buddha. Later, by chance, he was rescued by Lin Rui who went down the mountain to practice, and then they formed a master-servant contract. Being a servant of the master and being with you for a long time is better than a family member. In order to be able to accompany Lin Rui all the time, Kai Bao turned into a primitive bracelet. The bracelet became the body of Kai Bao, and the child in front of Lin Rui at this time was the spirit of Kai Bao. Lin Rui was a little bit painful when he was hit by Kai Bao. But all the pain melted in Kai Bao's grievances. She missed this little guy too. Kai Bao, I'm in a coma for a thousand years. To be more specific, it was one thousand and one years. A hang, he really did what he said. Master, you really came back. When you were crossing the catastrophe, your soul flew away. I tried my best to keep only yours. A trace of soul, and luckily I met Ahang later. He took me and shuttled to all planes and worlds, looking for your soul fragments. Kai Bao cried so much that he hiccuped and looked at Lin Rui eagerly. Hey? Master, why are you sitting on the ground? I was not hit by you. Lin Rui stood up silently, holding Kai Bao's rolling little hand, but a huge wave was set off in her heart. But when my soul was gone, Ah Sing's cultivation base was still very low, how could he shuttle to the various world planes? Master, after you failed to cross the tribulation, your soul has been asleep, and I don't know what happened later. In those years, Axing looked for your remnant soul fragments while working hard to cultivate. Later, he became the immortal gate of Kanglin continent. The Xingyun Zionzun is. He is very hard in his cultivation. I have never seen a person practice so hard, like crazy. When Kai Bao recalled the days when he had followed Ah Sing, he still had lingering fears and was full of emotion. If it wasn't for the idea of resurrecting Lin Rui to support him, I'm afraid Ah Sing would be crazy. Lin Rui felt a pain in her heart. As she lost her soul, she wondered if anyone would save her. But I didn't expect that the one who saved her in the end would be Ah Hang. The little beggar she found. For more than a thousand years. How did he stick to it? Lin Rui's heart was agitated, she quickly looked around, Kai Bao, what about Ah Hang now? Kai Bao was silent. Little people, with pink makeup and jade, very cute. But at this time, after listening to Lin Rui, Kai Bao's eyes were filled with sadness. He whispered, I don't know where Ah Sing is now. When Ah Sing found your last soul shard, he found that the soul shard was divided into two, but at that time Ah Sing had already exhausted his mana. Lost. In the end, Ah Sing had to drive the half of the soul fragment into my space first, and he told me to wait for the half of the soul fragment to be reincarnated, and then I fell asleep, and I don't know he will go later. Where is it? Lin Rui stood there with red eyes, she clenched her fists tightly. Axing, this fool. Since Kai Bao concluded a master-servant contract with Lin Rui, he has never seen Lin Rui cry. At this time, Lin Rui, with a weird hairstyle, was weak, 
as if a gust of wind would blow away, and his eyes were red. If it weren't for biting his lips tightly, I'm afraid, the tears have slipped. Kaibeo was also uncomfortable. He didn't want to see Lin Rui like this. Kaibeo pulled on Lin Rui's striped medical gown, and said softly, Master, don't be sad. Fortunately, now that you are awake, let's go find Ahang together. Well, I will find him. Lin Rui took a deep breath and suppressed the deep sadness in his heart. Now her top priority is to look at the cultivation talent of this body. She has to practice again first, so that she can travel across various planes to find Ahang. But with Kai Bao's help, after Lin Rui checked his physical condition, her pretty face suddenly sank. This body of her turned out to be, waste material with all five spiritual roots. This is a genius of cultivation, after sleeping for a thousand years. Waking up but became a waste of training? For a long time, Lin Rui did not speak. Kaibeo was also surprised. It stands to reason that the original owner of this body, the reincarnation of the last half of the soul fragment, is considered to be of the same origin as the owner. After all, it can't be such a wasteful physique. For cultivation talents, mutant spiritual roots are the strongest, followed by single spiritual roots, followed by double spiritual roots. Three spiritual roots and four spiritual roots, even the inner gate of the immortal gate could not enter. Unless there are some special talents, they will be allowed to stay in the inner door. Lin Rui, who was a mutated golden spirit root, used gold as a tool, a super strong female sword repairer. And now, after leaving Kai Bao's space, Lin Rui was lying on the hospital bed. She stretched out her hand and looked at her slender fingers. The spiritual energy in this world is scarce, so it is not suitable for cultivating immortals. Plus her physique. However, let's not say that she was originally a proud person, and could not accept herself as a waste material that could not be cultivated. Only because of Axing's contribution to her, she can't assume that nothing has happened, she can't just give up like this. Axing. Lin Rui closed his eyes, but secretly made a decision in his heart. Now that he has come alive, what about the physique of waste materials? Shi Lin Rui will never give up. I will definitely practice again. And, Axing, I will definitely find you. Just like that, a few more days passed. Although Lin Rui's body is temporarily unable to cultivate, the spring water from the eternal life spring in the Kai Bao space can quickly recover Lin Rui's injuries. Including her fractured calf, she will soon recover. Originally, that spring water had more uses. But now, whether it is Lin Rui or Kai Bao, they are much weaker than before, so the spring water can only make people healthy. It is enough for Lin Rui who wants to solve the waste material physique as soon as possible. At the very least, she can be discharged as soon as possible instead of lying in the hospital all the time. If you want to improve your physique, you must look for opportunities. After all, being confined to the hospital, she couldn't do anything. During the few days when Lin Rui was hospitalized, Su Man came over several times, and Lin Rui didn't bother to care about this woman. Just watching her perform with cold eyes. Not to mention, Su Man's acting skills are good, after all, she was a small star in the fourth and fifth line. Lin Zikang didn't come too many times, it was because he was too busy to run at home and abroad. But once he had time, he would come to see his daughter Lin Rui. When Lin Rui was about to be discharged from the hospital a few days later, there was a man and a woman in her ward. The boy looks 16 or 17 years old, and he is very handsome. The whole person looks like that kind of pampered young master. The young master has been frowning since he came in. But after seeing Lin Rui's new image, the disgust between his eyebrows actually solidified. Another girl, with red lips and white teeth, big eyes, fair skin, black and long straight with bangs, looks like a good girl. Although it has long been heard that Lin Rui cut her hair and removed the smoky makeup. But after seeing Lin Rui's makeup after removing makeup, 
a touch of jealousy still flashed through the girl's eyes. Damn, Lin Rui looks so good without makeup. Even if the hair is as short as a boy. It is so beautiful that it even compares those female stars. Especially after seeing the boy around him, he was in a daze, Lin Xiao immediately said, Sister, I will come to see you with Brother Jin, and Brother Jin has something to tell you. Lin Rui raised his head and quickly seated the two people in front of him from memory. The man's name is Yang Jin, the young master of the Yang family, and Lin Rui is a childhood sweetheart. Girl, it is Su Man's biological daughter, Lin Zikang's stepdaughter, Lin Xiao. She is also her nominal sister. Lin Rui looked up calmly, what's the matter? Obviously Lin Rui's words did not contain any emotions. After all, for Lin Rui at this time, whether it was Yang Jin or Lin Xiao next to him, she didn't pay attention to it. Lin Rui is now focused on practicing, and then goes to axing. However, Yang Jin still felt the alienation in Lin Rui's tone. He thought, could it be Lin Rui's new moves? Lin Rui intends to make herself interested in her in this way of wanting to get caught? A touch of disgust flashed through Yang Jin's eyes. He said indifferently, Lin Rui, I am here this time to break the marriage contract with you. Although, I know you disagree, but I can't stand you anymore. The results are messed up, and I don't go to bars with people all day long. Just soak in the internet cafe to play games. This time I went to drag racing with others. It would be nice if you could drive the car away. Why would you go to drive a car with others? I. Yang Jin, would definitely not want you such a brainless fiancé yes. Therefore, our marriage contract must be terminated. Great. Yang Jin was taken aback. Just beside him, Lin Xiao, who was about to say something more, was stunned. Why, so easy to agree. Lin Xiao remembered that her mother had said in the past few days that after Lin Rui woke up, she was weird. She couldn't help looking up and down at Lin Rui who was sitting on the hospital bed. It may be that these two people were silent for a long time. Lin Rui raised her eyes slightly, a cold light gleaming in her deserted eyes. She directly issued the eviction order. Stop talking. Then go out, I'm going to rest. Yang Jin didn't know how she got out. This time, he couldn't bear it. He prepared a lot of excuses and he certainly didn't want to have anything to do with Lin Rui. As a result, those carefully prepared words are useless. Lin Rui agreed to dissolve the marriage contract of two people so easily. Although the bottom of my heart still has deep dissatisfaction with Lin Rui. But this time seeing Lin Rui's promise so happily, he thought, Lin Rui still has some advantages. At the very least, more self-aware. Here. Yang Jin left the ward and said nothing. Lin Xiao was worried. She still remembered that Yang Jin saw Lin Rui for the first time, but stayed for a while. Thinking of Lin Rui's beautiful face. Lin Xiao took two quick steps to keep up with Yang Jin's pace. She whispered, Brother Jin, are you really going to dissolve my eldest sister? But after all, she likes you so much. Just now, she must have spoken angry just now. My mother also said that after my eldest sister was injured, the emotional state is particularly bad, don't be angry with her. Although these few words at first glance seem to be telling Yang Jin not to break his marriage contract with Lin Rui, and not to be angry with Lin Rui. But when I think about it carefully, Lin Xiao said every sentence is saying that Lin Rui is not sensible, and Lin Rui has a bad temper. Also, it means temptation. Yang Jin is two years older than Lin Xiao and Lin Rui. He doesn't know what Lin Xiao meant. The reason why he brought Lin Xiao here this time, Yang Jin was worried that Lin Rui would continue to pester him, so he brought Lin Xiao. But now, no more. Yang Jin gave Lin Xiao a deep look. Xiao Xiao, you are still young, so study hard. I still have things to go. Yang Jin naturally understood Lin Xiao's mind. However, he will not be with Lin Rui because he hates Lin Rui, who is too bad after all. But he will never be with Lin Xiao. 
You know, although Lin Xiao's surname is Lin, it is not the Lin family, but the child Su Man brought to the Lin family. The biological father is still unknown. Therefore, the Uyang family would not agree that Uyang Jin was with Lin Xiao. Uyang Jin felt that Lin Xiao was simple and sensible and couldn't bear to hurt her more, so she turned down her calmly. Hope she understands. Looking at Uyang Jin's back, Lin Xiao bit her lip firmly. Why? Except that she is not Lin Zikang's biological daughter, she can't compare to that Lin Rui. Why did Brother Jin not give her a chance? Lin Xiao's eyes were red with anger, gritted her teeth, turned and walked in the other direction. And Lin Rui in the ward locked the door of the ward and entered the space of Kai Bao again. During this time, she has been meditating in the eternal life spring. Not only did the scars on his body recover so much that he couldn't see it, but the skin on Lin Rui's body became more and more delicate. The original owner used cosmetics indiscriminately and did not remove makeup well, and used to smoke and drink to stay up late. So even if he is very young, his skin is very poor. During this time, under the nourishment of Yang Shenquan, Lin Rui's skin became better and better, as delicate as egg whites. If it were not for worrying that the injury would heal too quickly, the doctor would find out that Lin Rui would have been discharged from the hospital long ago. Lin Rui had cut short hair at will. Later, she asked Lin Zikang to find a professional hairdresser and trim her again. Although it is still very short, it has a distinct hierarchy. Coupled with Lin Rui's sharp gaze and exquisite face, people can't even look away. There is an indistinguishable beauty. This is also the reason why Wu Yang Jin and Lin Xiao came to see Lin Rui in a daze. Because at this time, Lin Rui's style is very cold. When Lin Rui was meditating in the eternal life spring, Kai Bao sat on a small bench, grabbing his own things. He stroked his chin frowning and sighed old-fashioned. Hey, my treasures are gone, just a little bit of tatters. I've never been so poor. Kai Bao loves all kinds of treasures, and he is also very sensitive to treasures. If a treasure is born, Kai Bao must be the first to know. So when he was on the Kanglin continent, every time Lin Rui went down the mountain to practice, he would take Kai Bao to hunt for treasures. That is also the happiest thing about Kai Bao. Lin Rui looked at Kai Bao's sad little appearance, and shook his head dumbly. She stretched out her hand and rubbed Kai Bao's soft hair, and said confidently, Kai Bao, what we lost will definitely come back in the future. Well, I believe in the master. Kai Bao's eyes were bright with bling bling, full of trust and admiration for Lin Rui. Soon, Lin Rui was discharged from the hospital and returned to the Lin family. Lin Zikang came to pick up Lin Rui in person. But he frowned and remained silent. After arriving at home and sending Lin Rui to her room, Lin Zikang said very worriedly, Rui Rui, I heard Xiajin say that you agreed to break the marriage contract with him. And Lin Rui looked at the room left and right, the colorful decoration made her look really uncomfortable. Especially the curtains, which are actually studded with gems, are too prodigal. Lin Rui suddenly heard Lin Zikang's sigh, she turned her head and looked at him. Dad, my marriage contract with Yu Yang Jin is terminated, will it affect your business? Although it will affect some, it will not affect the fundamentals of my business. Lin Zikang looked at his daughter who looked very much like his wife and sighed lightly, but this marriage contract was originally made when your mother was pregnant with you. Xiao Jin's mother and your mother were handkerchiefs that grew up together. Yes, the two are like sisters, so if you don't stay with Xiajin. Although, whether it was the original owner Lin Rui or the current Lin Rui, they didn't have much impression of Fang Yuluo's mother who had an accident that year. But. Dad, if my mother is still there, she would also wish me happiness. Lin Rui looked back and smiled at Lin Zikang. She continued, I am still young, and I want to focus on learning first, and I will talk about marriage later. Dad, I was ignorant before, and it made you bother. From now on, I want to study hard and make progress every day. Lin Zikang. Oops, his eye circles are sour again. 
it's still itchy. But the daughter who suddenly became sensible, really moved him. After sniffing, Lin Ziking tried to maintain his father's final stubbornness. He nodded slightly and said, well, it's right to study hard first. Dad is looking forward to your progress. I will talk about marriage when you grow up. I still have things. I will ask Uncle Zhong to come and help you later. Change something. After saying this, Lin Ziking turned away calmly. But when he reached the study, he opened the door quickly, and then quickly closed it. The moment he closed the door, Lin Ziking touched the corner of his eye. Although his eyes were red, he raised his mouth proudly. Rui Rui is really getting more and more sensible. It's nice, but it's my child with you Luo. Lin Rui didn't know what was wrong with Lin Ziking, but she didn't think too much. After a while, the door of Lin Rui's room was knocked. Uncle Zhong is here. Uncle Zhong is over 60 years old. He is an able man of old man Lin back then. He has never been married, so he has always been at the Lin family. Uncle Zhong also knew that the eldest lady Lin Rui was apostate, and every day she painted strange and very spicy eye makeup, and went out to mess with people all day long. Mr. Lin Ziking has been very sad. Although this time I said that the eldest lady has changed her hairstyle, and she doesn't wear that kind of makeup that is neither human nor ghost. But Uncle Zhong was getting older, he still did not dare to have too much expectation of this eldest lady. What's more, the decoration of Lin Rui's room will be changed almost every few months. Miss, the husband said you want to change something. Well, replace all these things. The furniture is white. The curtains and sheets should be light blue or light yellow. Yes, don't be too fancy. Also, move these vases and crystals. What to do, asked my dad. Uncle Zhong was taken aback. Just want simple white furniture, and light curtains and sheets? So vegetarian? Uncle Zhong felt that he might be too old to hear clearly. In order to worry that the ancestor would make trouble later, so he asked again. But Uncle Zhong got the same answer. Uncle Zhong was a little suspicious, but didn't say much, and immediately turned around and arranged for someone to do the matter. And Lin Rui walked to the cloakroom looked at the colorful clothes inside, twitched the corners of his eyes. This original owner's taste is really not flattering. Among these various clothes, the only normal thing is the school uniform. But the school uniform skirt was changed to be super short by the original owner. Lin Rui expressionlessly compared the length of the skirt with her hand. 